Hi, I'm Cami. I'm a postdoc in the Grove Lab here at the MRC University of Glasgow Center for Virus Research, and I'm a co-first author on our new paper, Structures of Papasi, Pegi, and Pesti Viruses Envelope Proteins Suggest a Novel Membrane Fusion Mechanism. So envelope viruses, which are viruses covered in a membrane, need to fuse that membrane with the host cell membrane to achieve infection. This is normally done with proteins that are in this virus membrane called fusion proteins. There are lots of groups of viruses for which this fusion mechanism is unknown. The problem our research addresses is the unknown fusion mechanism of three groups of viruses called the Papasi, Pegi, and Pesti viruses. These groups of viruses include important human and animal pathogens, such as hepatitis C virus. There are currently 58 million people living with hepatitis C virus. So to determine how viral fusion proteins work, you first have to determine the structure. So historically, the structures of proteins were just determined using laboratory experiments. However, we're using a state-of-the-art artificial intelligence software called AlphaFold. So these traditional lab experiments could take months, years, even decades, just to get one structure. However, AlphaFold can do this within a matter of minutes. And so that has enabled us to predict protein structures from dozens of different viral species. We've discovered that the E1 protein, which is one of two membrane proteins on these viruses, have a conserved structure. That means they have the same shape. The similarity in this shape indicates that there's a conserved fusion mechanism across these groups of viruses. Also, the shape of E1 is unlike any known protein structure, and this suggests that we've also discovered a new type of fusion protein. This is an important step in understanding how these viruses get into cells. Additionally, this work will guide our experiments for the coming years. It may also help with vaccine design for viruses such as hepatitis C.